Hello lads, welcome back to the channel. My name's Alad for Set Play Gaming. We're doing the FIFA 23 Road to Glory career mode with Stevenage and AD Boothroyd. And episode 15, if you uh, want to go back and look at any of the other episodes, there will be a link in the description below to the playlist. Now the episode format is going to change ever so slightly, just to try and get the season progressed a lot quicker. As you can see, today we're going to be doing Leighton Orient away and Swindon in the Papa John's Trophy. And as you can see from that diagram, uh, it's showing you that episode 16 will be Barrow and Swindon in the league, and then Gillingham and Bradford to finish the month. Let's get on with today's episode. Let me know in the comments what you think of the changes. So, we've got Leighton Orient away, and we're at Brisbane Road. And this should be an interesting game. Leighton Orient are not doing that well in the league. And to say they're underachieving is a, a drastic, drastic statement but well, one that really reflects their dire consequences. Just one win in 10 games. So this really should be a straightforward win for us as we get underway in our purple strip and we're kicking from right to left. Hopefully today we should uh, bag the three points. They've been struggling all season, but we know how this game plays. Sometimes um, the... More difficult games are against the bottom of the table sides. Vanen gets into the book there with an aggressive early challenge. Well in by Van Koot and given away. Young and now knocked on. Drinnen. Oh, good save. Kind of parried it to his side there, Chapman. Reeves into Rose. Rose back in. Oh, he's cleared away. Beckles, oh it's a poor clearance, Norris, oh, what a good chance that was, right in front of goal, you'd have at least thought he could have put that on target, Gotts, good turn, Robbie Gotts, into Rose, there's the turn, can he get the shot away, no he can't, and it's good defending from Leighton Orient, into Reeves, 35 minutes played, Here's James Weldon, Norris, into Rose, and into Gotts! Oh, just need to work on his development, try and get him as a secondary striker so his attack position and finishing go up. Oh, that's an aggressive tackle on Rose. And Leighton Orient with a chance. Monker goes through, great chance! Oh, and Chapman comes out, and he squandered it. Almost half time and Beckles goes in with a challenge. They've been aggressive as we have entered the final third. Gotts. Norris holds it up. And it's Reeves. Reeves. Yes. Come on. Off the post. Great hold up play from Norris. It wasn't Norris. It was Rose. Rose with a good hold up play. And Jake Reeves in off the post. Nice. Great finish from Reeves. And Jake Reeves with his third goal in nine matches. Not bad from a central midfielder. And at half-time, we have a 1-0 lead over Leighton Orient. It's been difficult. Just as I said, we predict that we should win. But these teams that are at the bottom, they scrap and fight and make things difficult. Moncur probably should have had a goal themselves with Moncur's chance. And Sotirio in behind. A chance, he pulls it back. And a great save from the front post from Chapman to keep it 1-0. El Mizuni. Well in by Clark. He wins it back. Gotts exchanges a 1-2 and Clark down the left. This is good progress. Back inside. Gotts drops his shoulder. Gets around his man. Robbie Gotts. And there's Amu. It's two. David Amu at the back post. Lovely drop of the shoulder from Robbie Gotts. He can't really score that much, but he certainly can create. That's a wonderful cross to the back post. And David Amu, inside the six-yard box, isn't going to miss that. Well, not our first-choice striker. He's done well. Reeves. Into Norris. Here's his goal. Yo! Off the crossbar. Look at that. Uh, Vigaru comes out and he just chips him and look at this. You can hear almost hear it. Ding. Off the crossbar. 
Tanubu plays it wide, it looks like he's picked up a knock, Clark, Amu pulls wide to the left, inside to Robbie Gotts, Gotts, into Norris, Norris with a chance, back to Robbie Gotts, here's Robbie Gotts, and there's the third, wonderful link up play, wonderful interchange, and Gotts makes the run into the box, and that's a great finish, and he does have a goal today. A goal and an assist for Robbie Gotts. What an absolute jewel of a player. And the final score is 3-0. A great win. Let me know in the comments what you think about that. Some great news today to give to you. Elliot List is back and available for selection. We've been working the last couple of weeks to try and get him back to full fitness. He's been out with a dislocated shoulder. So... You know, we're going to be looking at physical contact. It is the Papa John's Trophy, so not that much emphasis placed on it, but it'd be a good run out for him to test about whereabouts he's at. So this is the Swindon Town lineup today, and the players probably to look out for, Ben Gladwin running from midfield, Therese Shade on the left wing, and then Jeff Cott through the middle. So 4-3-3, a very attacking lineup by Swindon Town. Um, certainly can't underestimate them. Um, right now, we've just got this, this lineup. Um, it's kind of similar to the Carabao Cup lineup. Like I said, I am focused more on the league, but this gives some of the fringe players a chance. As you can see, Pierre Gianni and Reeves, more senior members that play in the first 11, uh, but that's due to the fact that we just don't have the numbers right now. Campbell could turn. Here's List. Turns on the ball away from Clayton, and it's List. Chance opens up. Ooh. A good early sighter for him in the opening seven minutes. <clears throat> Be interesting to see what happens when the ball gets swung in and he's got to have some physical contact. Campbell turns, pulls it back inside. It's List, edge of the box. Elliot List, he's trying to bend it into that far corner. A little bit closer, he's getting closer. Here's Khan, inside to Shade, who's actually come infield. Well won by Pierre Gianni, but given away. Khan plays it in, and a chance here for Jeff Cott. Oh, and a good save by Ashby Hammond. The unknown goalkeeper makes a great stop there. Probably should have been 1-0 to Swindon. It's a, probably the best chance of the game. Pulls it back. Wakeling now to Clayton. Back to Gladwin. Ball inside. Oh, and he's turned. Oh, he's put it over the bar, though. Half an hour played, Khan intercepted by Agunbo as he steps into midfield. Campbell, that's a long ball, intercepted by Clayton. Oh, given away by Clayton and a chance here for Elliot List. Yes! David Amu did the right thing there. He did the right thing. He scored in the last game, in the league game. And he was presented with a chance by Clayton. And instead of going for, I guess the greedy option would be to shoot, he sets up Elliot List nicely. Almost half time. A gumbo wins it back. What was that for? That wasn't a free kick, surely. Watch him score from this now. Yandolo. Yandolo. Ooh. So at half time, it's 1 0. Thanks to Elliot List, a mistake by Clayton at the back, presenting the chance. And Amu sets up List. Let's hope we can seal this out in the second half. Well intercepted by Faulkner. Knocks it on. Bostwick goes wide to Campbell. And Campbell's got Saxon early out on the left. Can he get the cross in? In he comes. And there's Elliot List. A beautiful cross from Saxon early and a fantastic header. Look at the way he attacks the ball here. Edge of the six yard box. Thank you very much. And it's a brace for Elliot List on his return. I think he's ready, don't you? God, I can, I'm just salivating at the idea of Norris playing target man and List running off him. Keep in mind, guys, that List has been out since pre-season, so we haven't really used him in League 2. List! Oh! Almost his hat-trick. Smith 
Crosses it in. Knocked away. It's Campbell. Brings the ball down. Dean Campbell. Campbell. Oh, that's a good run. And now Saxon early back into the box. Rose brings it down. Rose. Oh, and pushed away by Sol Brin in the Swindon Town goal. See, <laughs> where's the defence? Nine minutes left. Jeff Cott. They've got to get a goal here from this attack, Swindon. If they hope to. And a gumbo gets his head to it. Oh, but it's knocked down. Jeff Cott. A gumbo again. Comes back. Oh, and he's blasted it over the bar. And the Swindon Town fans not happy with Darcy there. Inside, Amu. Just a few minutes left. David Amu. Oh, step over. Can he pull it back? Back to Smith. Crosses it in. Reed is there. And it's three. It's not been as easy as it looks from these highlights. But Reed here, Arthur Reed off the bench. How does he have enough time there? I guess the Swindon manager will be asking how he has enough time to volley that in. So the final score is 3 0. The main story, the main talking point is Elliot List is back. And hopefully we can get him some league games now. Let me know. Drop a comment below. Let me know what you think. Alright, guys, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the action. I'm going to try and condense the highlights down. Not too much to give you enough quality so that you still enjoy them. And as I said, squeeze those uh, games into each episode. Uh, just keep it at two and see how we get on. Let me know in the comments um, if this format works for you. And uh, I'll see you guys in a couple of days. See you guys soon.